Wow, this Let's Play is really good. Too bad it sucks! Hey guys, again here. Welcome back to Let's Play Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep. With me, the Kidney, which I said twice. Once again, I'm very sorry for no uploads. Although it was four days ago when I recorded this, which is September 24th at 2 o'clock. Which is a Saturday. 2 o'clock a.m. No, it's p.m. Um, so yeah, we're here at a... Uh, What's this place called? Keyblade Graveyard? Haven't played this since I last recorded it. One thing I didn't say last time is that on this map, the clouds move. And if I could actually... You can't see the clouds on this, uh... You can see them moving. Yeah, it's pretty pimp. Pimptacious. But they move faster, seems like, on the first screen. So in this episode... Some of you may not like it, but I feel like I have to do it. And I haven't had videos in a while, which is probably even worse, but I just, I, you know, I, I want to do it, so. Meh. So, what we're going to be doing is getting all, getting all the leftover stickers with Terra and all the leftover chests. So, the easiest way to check is go to reports and see what we're missing here, brother. <laughs> we did all the story, apparently. I love how it says you're done with the story when you get there. When you get here. Xanet report. I believe that's all of them except for Terra's final boss report. But we'll get that. Hopefully I don't forget it and then I have to go back and... Eh. Okay, so. One thing I never did was arrange the stickers that I've picked up. You arrange the stickers every time. Depending on where you actually place the sticker, it gives you a certain amount of points. I place some of them. And then the more points you get, you get certain rewards. Like, you know... Where would this go? Where would it be perfect? You know, if I put it on the ground, you're going to hear a noise. It's like, doink. It gives you five points. Okay, we do it up here. It gives us seven points. Because that's where it would go. So we're just going to be getting the rest of them. So, oh, where would balloons be? Yep. Anyway. Oh, well, he's knocking these over, right? Well, he's in the process. See? Fireworks. That is a command that boosts something when you use it after a battle. But anyway, so we're going to look at the stickers we're missing. And there's no exact way to check. But we're going to start um, with the chess anyway. So we'll get back to this. So we're going to go to treasures now. Look at the treasures. We have all treasures in Land of Departure. All treasures in the Enchanted Dominion. All... Uh, never mind. Let's see what we're missing. Let's start somewhere easy. There's one in Keyblade Graveyard I do not have, which we can all guess where that is. It's in Twister Trench. So I will... Basically what I'm going to be doing is I'm just going to cut ahead to where I get the chest, and I'll show you guys. And I might fight some enemies along the way. If I get caught in a tornado, I'll cut out of it, you know. Here it is. That's where it is. And I believe it said High Potion. So I'll see you guys at the next location. Let me just finish these guys off. Okay, now that we got that, <coughs> now we're gonna move on to the next area. Let me look back at reports, because I wasn't paying any attention. Oopsie. I should probably pay more attention. I mean, I was just basically talking. I scrolled all the way down. So, Dwarf Woodlands were missing too. <coughs> ah, I cough way too much. Okay, I'll see you guys at Dwarf Woodlands. Woodlands. Bye. So now, if we look over there, I'm pretty sure that's where it is. We couldn't reach this obvious. We couldn't reach this earlier due to obvious reasons. You definitely can't make that jump. It's a shot lock flame cell mode. Actually, Ventus, I'm pretty sure, starts out with it. That's his first one. And he just shoots out fire. Yeah, it's weird how Ventus starts with flame cell mode, which I'm pretty sure. He does, right? Anyway, see you at the next chest. Dwarf Woodlands also, because we're missing one more. Now, if you take a look to our left, here's that uh, Dwarf Woodlands sticker. There we go, Louie sticker. <coughs> now, I just stopped by to get that, because I saw it. And it was right in front of me, right? I was checking for the chest. I was pretty sure it wasn't one of these. But I was just making sure, because I don't have to come back. But then I saw that sticker, I'm like, hey, I'll get it. So, I just got it. See you at the chest I was supposed to be getting to. Huh. 
So now, if you just saw that, you gotta hop up on here. You can get up on this top thing and then you can just scoot on over and grab this chest. Fission for Aga, which we worked so hard to get. But we needed high jump anyway, and by the time we had high jump, I'm pretty sure we had Fission for Aga. So, I'm pretty sure that 100%'s Dwarf Woodlands right there, unless we're missing stickers. But, besides that, yeah, we have all the chests, so I'm pretty sure that's 100% Dwarf Woodlands right there. <clears throat> like I said, unless we're missing stickers, which I can't exactly check, because they don't tell you. But I'm pretty sure I got them all. And if not, whatever. Anyway, if I could just look, I'm pretty sure it said Enchanted Minion. But I'm just gonna make sure again. Reports. Open that crap up, man. Okay. Treasures. Okay, now we have them all in Enchanted Minion. We're going to Castle of Dreams. We're missing two chests. Mystery, 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 mystery. That's a good treasure. That helps you beat the game in one shot. Just kidding. See you there. And here we are, one of the chests. <coughs> you can remember last time we came up here, it automatically started that cutscene where of the um, escort uh, Cinderella, is it? <laughs> and here we are. I'm pretty sure it's a Wellspring Crystal. And there's one more we're missing, so uh, I'll see you guys there. One thing, there is a sticker up here. I don't know if I can grab it, actually. You can swing at it and hit it. Oh, there it is. Let me just... Flying balloon sticker. Okay, see you at that chest. Actually, you know what? The chest is right here. This one is pretty... You can easily miss it. Because when you hit this, you know, you go up here, it's automatically going to send you to the boss fight where he jumps back down. But when you stand up here... Or ballroom. When you stand up there... You know, it automatically sends you to the cutscene. You know, he stands up here, the unversed appears, and he jumps down to do the boss fight. But here you are, your chest. So you have to come back up here and grab it. Fleeting crystal. Okay. So, that's probably 100% also. Oh, and yes, I also checked, and that is that was 100% for um, Dwarf Woodlands. Now, ugh. just making sure my mic isn't muted. Let's check the next world. Wow. Oh. Radiant Garden, I am missing four chests. Let's not do that yet. We're only missing one chest in Disney Town. So let's go there. See you guys at Disney Town. Once again, I know you're sick of that music. So am I. See you there. Okay. Now, there are tons and tons of chests in Disney Town, all hidden around underground in that, uh, in the sewer area, which I showed you, which I think was for, uh, corrupted or something. But, uh, but fortunately, our chest is right here that I somehow missed in this brightly colored town. Potion. That's it, we're done. That may not be all the stickers, but that was definitely all the chests. So now we're going to be heading the Radiant Garden, so I don't know why I'm pulling this up, I'm still doing it. Um, yeah, so we're missing four in Radiant Garden. So, see you in Radiant Garden, and we're going to pick up those chizzes. Okay, so right here we got a sticker. I'm going to try to grab it. Airplane sticker. Okay, see so you at that chest again. <laughs> or whatever chest. Any of the four chests, basically. Okay, so we haven't actually ever come down here before. Last time we were down here was the boss fight, and then the world ended. <clears throat> so, this is pretty cool. Chest down here. So, yeah. See so you at the next chest that's right here. That's two. Two down out of four. Okay, so see you guys at the next chest in Radiant Garden. Just look at this view. Like, under the walls. Okay, see ya. Okay, so basically they set this up so you can jump over here till at, at least you have high jump and um a level one. That's Thunder Surge. And that's Fleeting Crystal. And at least a level one air dash. Oh snap. To uh to get those two chests. So that's all the chests in Radiant Garden, but obviously you can see if you look to the left, there's a sticker. So I just gotta get these guys out of my face. And try to do this. Wow, that was horrible, Terry. And this guy's back. And so all I gotta do is hope and pray 
There we go, Dale sticker. That should be everything in Raiding Garden, except for maybe a sticker or two. Okay, so our next spot. Making our way through, making our way through. Hmm, it is. Oh, we're missing one in Olympus Coliseum. How did I miss one? Anyway, there's only four. Anyway, okay. I'll see you guys there. Okay, I don't know how I missed this, but it's right here. There we go. Fire strike. It's just like a spinning fire attack. Also, I want to say one thing before we move on. There is a mini game you can play here. They're not all just in Disney Town. There's a mini game here you can play along with Hercules, Hercules, where you smash pots. So, um, let's see our next destination. That was pretty easy. <laughs> okay, that was pretty easy. And deep space. We are missing three chests. Neverland. Oh my God. There are a lot of chests we're missing. Hey, but we're missing none in Keyblade Graveyard. So how many chests do we have left? We got... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. We got twelve chests. Well, let's move on. Let's move on. Deep Space! Ahoy! Or on we go. I suppose, right? right? Okay, so we got... One chest in here with all these rolly guys. <laughs> okay, two more to go. See you at the next chest. That's a pulsing crystal. Ow, ow, gosh. Oh, and here's the other chest. <laughs> that actually surprised me. Warp. I don't like using warp. Okay, see you at the last chest in deep space if I don't die from those enemies. And obviously you see this secret room right here that opens up after you beat the, um, the world. I'm pretty sure. And here's the last chest. Mind Square. That can help. That can help. Uh, there's nothing down this way. Because that's for, um, Aqua and Ventus. Or either one. Oh, I know who it is. You'll find out later. So, next world, it's Neverland. Why am I checking? I don't know. See you guys in Neverland. Where I am missing uh, nine chests. See you guys there. So here's one right here a bounding crystal. The fact of the matter is, though, I'm pretty sure I know where a majority of these chests are. I don't know how, I don't remember how to get to that one spot, but I'll, I'll figure it out. It's okay. Oh, well, yeah. There's someone here. Originally, when you come to the world, you're kind of joined, quote, you know, Captain Hook, so Peter Pan was not on your side. But now, once you finish the world, you are allowed in Peter Pan's little hideout. There's a sticker, Dewey sticker, and you get to talk to all of his friends, too. Ah, oh, I wish I could decide on my most favorite treasure. What does this guy have to say? Oopsie! I just destroyed your house. Okay, X is talk. I just hit it too. Pan's real good at games. He makes everything lots of fun. Even fighting with Hook and those smelly pirates, which isn't really a good thing, but Disney kind of decided to do that. Here we go, big chest. And it's not the map either. It's Mega Magic Recipe. And Shimmering Crystal. Okay, see you guys at the next set of chests. Or the next chest. Either one. Bye. Now here's an area we've never been in. It's not much different, except he's shooting cannonballs at us. A little wimp. And I thought we had a we'd have we've had a chest. We would have a chest there, but we didn't. Okay, so this is an area we haven't been. And obviously, as you see, there's a chest right up here. And it's pretty pretty. It looks over the whole forest deal. And yeah, it's got waterfalls. Waterfalls. And anyway, we got that chest. Grab another chest right here. Oh. It's an enemy. What can you... 
Yeah, I was wondering, three big chests, one world, not gonna happen. Anyway, I'm s I haven't cut yet because there's a sticker, which is pretty difficult to get because I can't level up my high jump anymore, to my knowledge. And, um, um, it's way up there. And I will show you guys how to get it once I kill this punk. Okay. So, after we get this chest. Zero Gravaga. Oh my god. I still haven't cut too, that's kinda of funny. I'm just showing a battle. Okay. Anyway. To get this right here. You always want to start on this platform. Let's see if you look, he jumps equal to that. Okay? It's very difficult. You have to jump and then swing and hit it. And that's how you do it. And I'm gonna see how many tries it takes me. And you have to be lined up perfectly and hit it. Very close that time. There we go, rainbow sticker. Finally, I didn't even swing. Anyway, there's also another tactic you can do for that is actually get a fire dash move or any of the dash moves where he just flies straight for a while. You double jump and you fly straight at it. Or do one air dash and fly straight at it. So yeah, pretty sure I'll see you at the next chest. Okay, so there is a huge secret thing to Skull Rock, actually. There's a lot of climbing you can do. And if I didn't die, this would be a good way to demonstrate. Just show it off. So yeah, if you jump up the side, you can get to all these d different platforms that have chests and everything. Including this one, which is a fake. The real chests are on the inside, and you can go even higher up. Now if we come right here, we're going to be on a little platform. They're right here. And you can look off in the distance, there's another platform. So that's our Mega Elixir. Now, if we do this right, which shouldn't be too hard, there we go. You can grab this chest, and this chest, I believe we're only missing one. Our Solemn, that is a good move, that's a good command. And this should be the last chest. But it's all... No, no? Oh, sticker. Yeah, a chip sticker. Okay, so I believe... That is all of Neverland, guys. Where is Neverland? There it is! Or, at the actual island. So... I believe that's all of uh, Neverland right there. So, let's see what our next chest is. Wait a second! We're still missing a chest. <laughs> I'll go find that. See you guys in the next chest. Now, you come down here into this secret area. There's a chest up here. Which is, if I can stand up here, whoa. A secrety cool move. Secrety cool move. Dark Haze. So, guys, you know. Whoa, gosh, okay. You know what this means? That's all the chests in the game for Terra Story. Yeah, treasures. We got a Mickey Mouse sign. That means 100% all treasures. Now we're gonna move on the stickers. So first thing we're gonna do to get out of the way is, or first thing we're gonna get out of the way is just place all our stickers. Is arrange all of them. So I'm just gonna pick uh, them. Okay, see, they wouldn't go well in the air. You put them on the sideline, I can... Oh, wait. On his shoulder. Nope. On the sideline. Where do you want them, okay? Oh, is anywhere good? I guess it is. He's jumping. He's, like, standing up here on one foot. Okay. And he's flying next to him. There you go. <laughs> and we got this airplane. Wait, was that... Oh, that was not good. What? It's an airplane. Really? He's flying. Yeah! Okay, you can see we just got a prize there. Let me just throw the rainbow up here. 
Got another flying deal. What the heck? What am I looking at here? Oh, he's flying off into the sky. Let's go this way. Then we got this blimp thing. Or hot air balloons. Sonic Blade. Mm, we're getting tons of stuff, guys. Another airplane. Wait. What do you got? It's like Terra's just sitting out the battlefield. Hmm, I wonder where this sticker should go. Yeah, a, a UFO. Why? I don't know. A balloon. A balloon will go with the balloons. Secret gem. Now that is the last reward you get for placing stickers. So yeah, what is this balloon? Okay, now we are missing one... Two, three, four. We're missing four stickers, that's it. Let's look at sticker collection, see which one we're missing. We're missing two in Disney Town, the only two. One in the Mysterious Tower, and one in the Enchanted Dominion. Let's go to Mysterious Tower to start with. See you guys there. Ding, 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 ding. Oddly enough, the stickers right here. Ding, 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 I'll see you at Disney Town. Yeah, really. Look out the window. Okay, so right here, um, you have to turn on the generator. I did show this in a previous video, but it got lost. You probably know. You gotta turn on this generator with lightning attacks. But the easiest thing to do is not just use lightning, like, straight up. Just hit it a bunch, use Thunder Surge, and then keep hitting it. Uh, and uh, it usually should uh, put you into the uh, lightning command change, and then you just hit it that way. And if I hit it a bunch, I guess it's so close. See, now I go lightning, and I just hit it. Or you can just get a bunch of thunders and do it. And it turns all these machines on, and it becomes a crazy platforming section. Which is really fun. But I'm here for this sticker. And it's up here. So we'll go ahead and grab that. I'll see you when I grab it. Now, you can probably see it right down there. Now, with all this crap moving around, it could be difficult to go and grab. So, you can try to finagle your way down, or just jump for it, you know. And screw it up, major big time. And there we go, Pete's sticker. Now, the next sticker is in the pinball section. That's right, I said pinball section. I also demo- I demoed everything. <laughs> and, um, I mean, you probably saw the racing video where I got the victory line. That one didn't get lost or messed up. Well, that one I did where I showed the whole area and all the other mini games. This platforming section is real cool. You gotta jump. Like, I see how those gloves are moving up and down. You have to jump with the timing of those gloves and all that. And now, and there's also a pinball section where you have to uh, hit all the uh, little hit all the crown buttons. You control yourself like a pinball. And you get shot up everywhere. It's a giant pinball machine. You gotta hit all the crown buttons that open up the door. And there's a bunch of chests in there. But it also leads to the roof of this building. And that's where we're going. See you when I get the sticker. So now when you make it up on the roof and you can see everything so pretty and all the balloons and everything, you're gonna notice where's my sticker. Well, it's over there. Way over there. You're gonna have to stand on these boxes and get over there. But what sucks is if you miss this jump. If you miss this jump, you have to go all the way back around through the sewers and everything. So if you just hope and pray enough and tap square like you're crazy, you can get the sticker. There we go. 100% Disney Town, everybody. 100% Disney Town. So our next area is Enchanted Dominion. I'll see you guys there. Okay, guys. You have... oh, look at his foot sitting up there. Um, this is the sticker that I showed you a long time ago in what, like the third, fourth episode? 
that you can't get until you have high jump. Look at this, we have high jump now. So you just gotta scoot your way over there. And then miss it horribly. I'm really bad at these jumping parts. I like how I can just air dash all the way back up to where I was standing. Whoa, suckage. There we go, Huey sticker. Now you know what that is. You know what that means. That means... Wait, let me get out of all the battle. That means we have all the chests and all the stickers in Terra Story now. See for yourself. You better believe it. Now, all we gotta do is arrange our stickers. So let's just do that now. Why not, huh? Mm -hmm. Okay, so what do we get? You're missing four, right? Traffic cone is gonna be standing up over here. Makes sense, right? This balloon. Be encompassing all other balloons with this mighty balloon power. This duck. Wait. We'll be over here. This is just one clustered thing. It's crazy. And... Where should he be? He's a little... Not the correct size, but whatever. And there we go! The sticker album is complete! And we got all our secret gems and our solemn and stuff. So that's awesome. Well, this has been quite... The episode... Of Let's Play King Bards of Birth by Sleep. But now we're finally at the end and I'm moving to a save point. So guys, the kidney signing out here. See you guys next time on Let's Play King Hearts Birth by Sleep.